so this probably depends a lot person to person i mean that that depends on what your priorities in life are it depends uh, on on the country that you live in um in my opinion absolutely i strongly recommend postdoc is just a great time it's the best position in your life you can just focus on research focus solely on research really do research expand your research give you some more perspective will be helpful so this probably depends a lot person to person uh, i would say yes just because it gives you a lot of un unstructured time to you know think about your favorite problems as you know right once you start the faculty job there's just so many things to do you have to teach you have to you know you've got students and you have to write for uh, write uh, grants and you have to probably participate in various committees for i don't know masters thesis this thesis that thesis so time gets very fragmented and i feel that it's probably good to give yourself a, a little bit of this uh, free time where uh, there's nothing being expected from you except your research i mean that that depends on what your priorities in life are um if you care for just getting a very good job in in a very good university then you can take a call depending on how well you're doing during your phd right um if you think that doing a postdoc doesn't increase your chances of getting this position then then maybe doing a postdoc uh, doesn't make sense but if you care for uh, an experience in a different research environment uh then i highly recommend um like doing a postdoc uh, this is uh, this it might give you like a change of uh, uh air and uh, you might sort of learn you know from uh different sort of people who have like different um, uh perspective on on uh, on research um in my opinion absolutely uh, i think there are many reasons to do so firstly um it helps in diversifying one's research interests skill sets um and definitely with building new connections one also gets to mentor uh, phd students uh, i think it's a gentle way to get out of your comfort zone and try to become more independent so in my opinion absolutely do a postdoc before you start a faculty or a research lab position Oh, well, my suggestion is after a PhD, um, no matter is a postdoc or research lab position or just a long vacation, uh, choose the ones that you think uh, will, you know, uh, uh, add to your perspective or change your perspective, so that you don't always stay in your comfort zone and uh, give you some more perspective will be helpful. I think yes, for for most cases, um, but I guess, of course, that. depends a lot on whether you you will find a good uh, postdoc advisor or postdoc group that fits your research interest but uh yeah i think the general postdoc is a very good period of time for maybe uh many people it's, it's a time that uh, you can just focus on research and without like many emails obligations uh, from that like, yeah various parties yeah i strongly recommend to uh, um to go through at least one postdoc uh, position um research requires uh, maturity and a lot of experience and um it's really helpful to move to a new lab and uh see and work with other people and get the experience uh of um uh seeing how other people work because up until you finish your phd you basically work with your phd advisor and many a couple maybe a couple of students that shared uh the same lab with you um so it's very very important to to sort of uh uh go to re- see other people how they get more experience expand your networking it's good it's a good thing to do postdoc because it's the best position in your life is a position that you can research most of the time without any other obligation 
And one more uh, piece of advice for postdocs, try to find a postdoc that can be, is uh, from the beginning for two years or can be easily extended because otherwise you spend your postdoc uh, searching for a job. And then the, the good thing about the postdoc is gone because you are busy and uh, stressed and all this stuff. Again, this question I think also is a question that depends uh, on, on the country that you live in. And for us, you know, a postdoc is uh, almost considered a must. So um, if, if you apply for a position without a postdoc, uh, people will try to understand whether you have a good explanation. And I guess maybe the only convincing explanations would be, you know, some personal reasons that, uh, you know, prevent you from going to another country or something, I you know, your spouse or something. But uh, so th there is these technical issues that it's really needed. But I think there, the reason that it is uh, required in the first place is, uh, you know, Israel is a small country. Um, also, you know, from the research point of view, uh, people are, somehow very similar to each other, or at least uh, not too many uh, types of research uh, are done because, you know, it's a small country, only very few universities. And the postdoc is an opportunity, you know, to go to another place to, to hear, you know, different approaches or different point of view on uh, research and, uh, um, I don't know, for example, let's talk concretely about cryptography. I guess uh, uh, the theoretical part in Israel is very strong. Maybe the applied side uh, is less, or at least in, in the academia, maybe is less. In industry is very strong as well. Um, so, you know, if people are going to, to a, a, you know, to university in the US where they can, do more applied uh, type of research, uh, security and stuff like that. It uh, broadens their, uh, you know, uh, uh, skills and uh, knowledge and everything. And then when they apply for a position, I think uh, they are more mature and more attractive. I think in general, it's different for each person and it also depends on what is the current probably job market in terms of faculty positions but i think in general it's definitely helpful to have a postdoc position because it gives you some time to expand your research uh, record and it also you can use this time to get acquainted with things like writing grants and starting to understand some of the other responsibility of a faculty that are beyond what the regular PhD student will do. Yeah, I absolutely do. Uh, the postdoc is just a great time uh, in your academic life. Um, it, it's a time when just you get a lot of freedom uh, to do what you want to do and don't have all that many responsibilities that you get later on as a faculty member. Um, so I, I absolutely would encourage people to do postdocs. It's also a great time to um, learn somebody else's research style other than just your advisor. So you get exposed to more different perspectives, different uh, types of research styles. Um, and just, yeah, uh, uh, but, but probably the most best thing about it is just the, the freedom that, that you have to do research and to just focus on research without all of these other responsibilities. I really enjoyed my years as a postdoc. It's a great time to focus solely on research before taking on the responsibilities of a longer term position. Plus, it's a chance to spend some time in a different research group and work with new people. And I'm actually starting a professorship soon, which is largely a result of me doing a postdoc in that research group. In my case, I benefited from my postdoc experience, without which I wouldn't be able to find a faculty position. Now, looking back, my postdoc period is when I can freely do research without uh, diversions such as teaching or grant applications. So my answer is yes, I definitely recommend. 
but I guess it varies from person to person.